I, I just remembered a, a sort of practical use case. So from one of our customers, they were in a meeting and telling us like, okay, we, you know, the way we measured our um, performance on a risk uh, activity was when they were asked by, you know, executives like, so what is our exposure to uh, Ukraine or Israel? Right. And they were able to respond and they, they, they use this metric as a, as a, um, a you know, sort of a, a feather in their cap, right? They say like, Hey, we were able to respond within in less than an hour. We were able to respond and say like, this is the, these are the suppliers we have here. This is the exposure. These are the different contracts we need to renegotiate or think about or evaluate. Um, and these are the categories and sort of activities that are affected. And, and you know, that was, they were able to do that in less than an hour now. Yeah. And I think that's a good metric as well, because ultimately you're doing this for a business reason, not not for, you know, just managing risk. You're doing it for a business reason. And so the person who's requesting that from the business reason, like if they're getting their answer faster, they're happier. Um, and if it takes you three days, then, you know, that's or, or a week or, or, or three weeks like that's, you know, then that's uh, something to think about. So 